All right, so I'm changing out the uh, EGR valve. That's the part number right there. This is a 2008 Ford F-150 uh, XL. It's the 4.6 V8. So um, the truck was obviously uh, given a uh, the uh, service engine light. Took it to the uh, O'Reilly's Auto Part. They um, connected the uh, monitor, their little um, that little handheld device that they connect or whatever. Anyways, the uh, code that came out says that truck needs a new EGR valve. So I'm in the process of removing it now. Just kind of get up here so I can show you guys. So it's, it seems like it's a pretty easy um, fix, like or replacement rather. Uh, first thing I did was uh, disconnected this part right here. Um, if, if you have a little difficulty doing it, like I did, I went ahead and used um, used this tool right here. I don't even know where I got it from. Must have, I think I got it from AutoZone. I don't remember. Anyway, looks like that. So you just put it in there and um, kind of just pry it off little by little. Um, just kind of work your way in there and then it finally comes off. It's not that hard. Just kind of move it out of the way. Uh, next thing I did was um, disconnected this right here. And this one's just pr pretty much just press this down with your thumb and just release. As you can see right now, I have a um, breaker bar. I got this one at uh, Harbor Freight. So the reason I pulled this one out is because I was having issues removing um, this screw right here. And let me show you the uh, new part so you can get a better idea of what it is I'm talking about. So this is the new part right here. As you can see, there's one bolt and there's the other one right there. The, uh, the other bolt actually is in the box, but you get what I'm trying to say. So got one there and there's another bolt that goes there anyway uh, I was having trouble removing um, the ones that are currently on the truck right now so uh, I went ahead and busted out this uh, breaker bar here if you're wondering what type of um, socket that is it's a 10 millimeter Let me just double check real quick oh, I had another one around here somewhere but yes, it should be a 10 millimeter. Um, I tried using one of these. I know it's not an impact drill. And I tried using this to uh, loosen that bolt. Uh, unsuccessful. I went ahead and took the, the bar out. And um, you can see it's got the short socket extension and then I got the adapter here so I'm able to use this extension because the, the sizes are different from from the, what the breaker bars is requiring so this is the setup that I got I went ahead and um, I'm gonna go ahead and unloosen it right now all right there you go that wasn't too bad and then we'll uh, repeat repeat the process. Like I said, there's another screw back over here in the back. Let's see if we can put that in there. So you guys can see it. It's right where my finger is at. Wherever my finger is at right there. The quality is pretty bad. Should be right there. Anyway. Process and um, should be good. One thing I failed to mention was I already had unloosened this other part right here. This one right here. And for that, use a uh, open wrench. 
it's a uh, one and one sixteenth. In case you're wondering, it's a one and one sixteenth. So this one's already loosened. Let me see if I can loosen that part with uh, my hand there. Oh, not quite. Well, there it goes. That's probably not going to sound good if you have uh, headphones on. Sorry about that. Okay, well, before I completely take this one off, sorry about that. I'm going to put it back on. And then I'm going to try and take off the uh, that other bolt that's back there. So let me try and put it back over here. Just trying to find that bolt. Where is that? Oh, there it is. So once you get it on like so yeah look at me glove just tore well you want to be careful with that boys you don't want to tear the glove but like they say no glove no love all right let me uh, put this on real quick we just put this to the side real quick um, just want to bear with me guys can fast forward this part or you can just continue to watch if you want that's fine get the get the uh, I guess the full episode huh just trying to there you go okay I think I finally got it back on that boat Still there with me. All right, so I went ahead and unloosened that back, um, that bolt that's back over here. So I think, yeah. So it looks like I'm gonna be able to use the, um, can use a ratchet or um, maybe that um, drill. Let me see. I'm gonna I have a ratchet. regular ratchet wow at that making some progress here boys and I wish there was better lighting I know I'm moving a lot but it's kind of hard to film and um, talk concentrate and um, do your work at the same time Alright, 
you know what? I'm gonna kind of cheat a little bit. Let's see what I can do here. Again, this is a 10 millimeter socket. does have a, um, a gasket Good to go. 